I, when I saw the price, I couldn't believe it. Like I was like, surely. There was a lot of confusion. Yeah, I'm like, surely that price can't be right. Hi you guys, I'm Molly with Design Loves Detail and this is my husband Ben. Welcome to our channel where we share the best deals for your home. Uh, today we're excited to talk about appliances. Make sure you guys subscribe and hit the bell so you'll be notified of future posts as well. I'm really excited because I have found some designer look appliances that are going to save you a ton of money. So check it out. So on to the range. This is one I'm really excited about because when I was looking for my kitchen, first of all, my appliance budget for my house was like $10,000 which is sounds kind of like a lot, but really when you want nice appliances, it's not because you can spend that much on a fridge alone or on a range alone. And so I was just looking for an Italian range that could possibly squeeze into my budget. And then I saw this beauty. That's literally what happened like when I saw it. And I saw the price and I was like, no. I don't know that I remember you making no. that sound there were There were little angels. And I, when I saw the price, I couldn't believe it. Like I was like, surely. There was a lot of confusion. Yeah, I'm like, surely that price can't be right because it was honestly like $10,000 less than some of the other ones that look virtually identical. It looks like ones that are like $14,000. This one's about 5,300. Um, as of right now. As of right now, yeah. That price it has been increasing. Actually, when we got it, it was even less than that. But no reviews were out there. Literally, this range was hard to find anywhere and it was not reviewed. And so I just was like, I love it that much. It fits in my budget. We are going to take the plunge. What's crazy is that it really was that price and that I bought it with no reviews because I wanted it that bad. So you are lucky because I'm gonna tell you the ins and outs. This is the Hallman range and it is made in Italy, legitimately made in Italy. It does come with a one year warranty that covers um, everything. And you can also add on, I will link it for you below. You now can that it's available on, at Home Depot, you can add on their extra warranty, warranty too, so. which really isn't a bad price. So you could do that even for peace of mind, but I've been so happy with it. We've had it a year and a half and I love it. Like it's the best range I've ever had for sure. Here's the, the larger size. So this is, we have the 48 inch, and this also comes in, I believe a 40 inch, a 36 inch, um, there's a 64 inch, I believe. Um, basically, there's a lot of different size options with this range. The way that the heating is in these is really good because it's um, like true convection. Because it, because it heats from the back as opposed to from the bottom, from what he said. Oh, that's what it was. Then it actually works like a true convection should work. Uh -huh. Rather than having your heating element on the bottom, um, it's like more evenly circulated and all that. Which is part of the draw of an actual Italian range. Right. So the 48 inch one has, um, it's got really seven burners because you have the six standard ones and then underneath this griddle, which it comes with this griddle, and which is very heavy and awesome, um, is the one large burner. So it gives you a lot of, um, cooking surface area. And a lot of different, a lot of variants in the burners as well. Yeah, so some are you're right. Bigger, some, some use the double. small and the big at the same time. Some, anyway, so a lot of different options. Yeah, for that. like a double, this one had, this one here and this one here, they both have like the double flame. I'm sure if you're like a cook, you can appreciate that. I will say neither of us really are. Ben has recently become quite the chef. In our kitchen. And by quite the chef, we mean I make some food sometimes. But it's pretty impressive. So to show you guys kind of how these beautiful um, controls work, which I love because with Hallman you can select the color, the metal color. They've got uh, three or four different metal finishes. I of course went with the brass because I love the little pop of the different metal. I love mixing metals, which is one I um, will be teaching about soon too, um, how to mix metals in your home. But anyway, I'm gonna show you kind of how these work because some people get nervous about having these controls kind of at a level that your kids can reach. Uh, so first of all, there's a few things that they, a couple things they have done that, that help with safety. One is that if you're gonna turn on a burner, um, so you have to like actually hold it um, down for quite a while for it to actually stay on. Um, and you push in at the same time. That's how that works. And then if you're gonna use the oven, you're gonna set your temperature, which I will say the Hallman cooks a little bit warmer than some ovens. So we usually take off about 25 degrees um, when, from what the recipe calls for. 
So you turn that and then you're going to select your kind of cooking that you want. And the one that I use most is this um, one here. It's like a line at the top and a line at the bottom. Um, that's going to be similar to like convection cooking where you have even heat throughout. And then there are a bunch of other cool um, cooking types as well that you can kind of look up in the manual for different. Um, and the more you use it, of course, the more you can, can see all of the options it provides. Um, and when you want to turn the light on here, you're going to push this one in. So lights on, lights off. And then that will only turn on if your oven's on. So if it's on the off, then the light doesn't turn on. Um, over here is um, kind of the other controls. They, when you first get the range, you will want to make sure that you push these, um, I think it's these two buttons, you hold them down and then it's in the manual as well, um, just to fact check me, but um, you have to hold down a couple buttons until the symbol appears um, above the clock. It has like, it's like a cooking symbol with a little steam coming up. Um, that's how you know that the range is ready to use. I was nervous at first when I got mine because none of the burners were turning on and that was why um, you need to um, basically activate it to make sure it's ready to go. Um, I also love down here, they have, um, you know, your drawer for all your pots and pans and you can get, um, so you can see how mine's open down here. Um, they have a little piece that you can get that goes across the bottom. Um, if you want to have it go to the floor, I liked the open look. Um, and I had originally been worried about stuff getting stuck under there, but our, we just have a little stick vacuum and it fits under there fine. So it's easy to clean. Um, and I kind of like the almost more, um, true Italian range look of it, kind of more casual feel um, with it being open. But you can also get the little, um, I can't remember, kick, kick plate or whatever um, for down there in the whatever color of home one you have. And this does come in a variety of enamel finishes. This one that I have is the, um, I'm trying to remember the color name, antique white. So um, it is a little more of a creamy tone. It looks, sometimes the online pictures look almost yellow and it's not. Um, I would say it's just a really creamy white. And um, there's a true white if you want that. There's a black, there's a graphite. Um, they have bright fun colors like blue and green and red. They even have um, a stainless one, that, which I just used in a client project. Um, I will have to put some pictures of for you. Uh, it's stainless with the brass. It's so beautiful as well. So tons of different color options and I've just been super happy with it. So uh, the savings is amazing. It's like half the price of most Italian ranges. And you know, I just really like it. One more thing I was gonna tell you guys about the color of this one. I did color match it um, with Benjamin Moore. Nivius um, is the color that it is closest to. And if you wanna see the swatch up against it, you can also go check out my Instagram stories under um, my kitchen highlights. Uh, you can see the exact um, color that I found that looks nearly identical. So that will help you um, if you're trying to see, match this to cabinets and things like that. Thank you for tuning in and checking out our range that we're loving. We will be sharing more product reviews, so be sure to subscribe and hit the bell um, to be notified when those are live. And uh, yeah, thanks for joining in. Yeah. Well, not that close. What the difference? That's nice. <laughs> it's real, real nice, guys. Well, right. well is, this, is this what we want for the video? Anything to add? Nope, but I looked over there in the middle of the video. <laughs> so.